Sunday, bitches. Where's my beer at? Sunday fun day, guys. What's going on, everybody? Uh, it's been a little bit since I did an update. Hopefully, it's not too dark in here like it was last time. So let me turn some lights on so it doesn't look as bad. If that doesn't make a difference, so well, fuck it. If you guys can even hear me because the car's running right now. So Sunday fun day. It's my only day off. I'm working mandatory 610s right now. Not much fun, but it is what it is. So plans for today. Go check on the house, see the progress, see if it's any closer to being finished. Number two, work on a project I started about a year ago. Um, talk about it with friends a couple times. Talk about uh, with Joe Miller with this and his uh, lovely girlfriend. Uh, an event I would like to start. It's a uh, Japanese supercars meet. Uh, I want it to be based around like the RX-7, the FD RX-7, the uh, fourth generation Supra, uh, the 3000 GT, the 300ZX, etc. Kind of want to have a meet just based around those cars or a car show exactly. Um, my, my idea behind it is to allow pretty much any car to come, but the premises behind it will be on those muscle cars or supercars from Japan of that era. Um, I'd like to hear what your guys' thoughts and inputs would be. Um, the plan is to have the event in Gettysburg. Uh, I'd like to have it right off 15 there so it's easy and accessible for people down the city to get to. So let me know what you guys think and uh, hope to hear from you all soon and I hope you have a great weekend. take the super for a drive today it's sunday fun day i don't get to drive it as much as i'd like to but oh well so i want to kind of get back to where i was saying before on the supercar meet or the japanese supercar meet i want this to be done sometime here within the next month i got to start looking for people that are willing to chip in any type of sponsors or anybody out there that would like to chip in or uh, any companies that someone might work for already that's willing to chip in let me know sorry I had to do that yeah it's way too much fun not to do that so I don't want this to be an expensive event I mean I was eventually I'm first gonna make it a meet the more I think about it the more and more I go over it I feel like it has to be a car show to give it the presentation I would like it to have I feel like a meet is a dime a dozen these days and my opinion they're kind of boring and attract a bunch of cars that I don't really want to see nine times out of ten that's maybe me being selfish or me being dick I don't know whatever but I just think most of the cars end up being shit and I don't want to see them so most of the paid events kind of weed those shit bag cars out and you all you got to do is you know donate five ten bucks to a charity which I haven't figured out that yet either um, I was gonna do wounded, wounded warriors but I've had a couple people say they don't like that charity that they kind of feel it's a lie but if anyone has any good charities of mine let me know um, I want to make sure the money goes to a good cause and I want to make sure it 100% goes to that cause I don't want it getting filtered out to some CEO of some charity either that's uh, that's one of my big pet peeves I see these these charities that uh, say all this money goes towards research for cancer or it goes to help someone out and 50 60% of it ends up going to some CEO or something else that has nothing to do with the research so I'd like to find something that will actually help the cause and actually help that person or that um, that issue out. So if you guys have a suggestion for that, let me know. Uh, sponsors, let me know. Um, if there's anything you guys would like to see at the event, um, I thought about getting a dyno, which would be a pricey, which would be a pricey item to get there. Um, I know Keith's pit stop is right there in Gettysburg, so it wouldn't be hard for him to bring out his rolling dyno. Uh, food, that's one big thing it must have. Food and music, I know what a big difference that makes when there is a DJ, it seems to keep the people staying longer. Food obviously helps people stay longer as they have food and refreshments, so I gotta find some type of food vendor or food truck, which would be awesome. I know food trucks are a new big thing now in the area, so if anyone knows any food trucks, that would be great too. So let me know guys what you think, and I'm just gonna continue to beat the piss out of the car the rest of the day. Enjoy yourselves guys, because I'm gonna enjoy myself. Fuck, that's fun. God, I love that noise. AC's on. Temp 
engines at 170 degrees. Air fuel's at a perfect 14.7 cruising. Gotta love it, man.